Hey guys, welcome. It's been a long time since I recorded a video. I know, and I'm so sorry. I've just been like busy with like work and school and stuff like that. So today's video is going to be just some shaving tips and hacks and stuff like that. And before I get started, I just want to say that today's video was inspired by the Gillette Venus Platinum Extra Smooth Razor. This was a complimentary product sent to me for free through the Influencer Box Box program for testing and reviewing purposes and stuff like that. Um... So yeah, without further ado, let's just get into it. If you have any shaving tips and hacks, go ahead and be sure to comment them below. And yeah. So number one is to not shave at all. People say like after you shave, like your hair goes back thicker and longer. And I'm not sure if that's like scientifically true, but I know like when I was younger and I saw like the little bit of hair on my legs, I wanted to shave it so bad. And now I feel like I just been shaving my legs all of my life now because it just kept going so I don't know if that's true or not but hair is really not that bad everybody has hair if it's not a lot just don't shave it number two if you have not shaved in a long time or this is your first time and it's like out of control trim the hair with scissors first so that it's easier to shave or whatever number like two and a half if you're not sure if you're old enough to shave yet ask an adult the first time I like tried to shave I didn't really have any hair but like I thought I did I was trying to shave my legs in a tub and I ended up cutting myself and I, because I was too scared to tell my mother I went and told my sister who then of course had to go tell my mother because I was bleeding and I cut my legs so if you don't know if you're old enough to shave or your hair is bothering you just talk to like your parents or your siblings or something don't just try to go at it with the razor because it's dangerous and it can cut you number three use conditioner um, whenever you're about to shave whatever part of your body, if you put condition on it, it'll like soften the hair follicles and make for like a cleaner shave. And it doesn't have to be like a good conditioner, you can use like any dollar store conditioner. But once it softens the hair, it basically gives you like a closer shave. And it'll be like soft afterwards, your skin be soft afterwards. Number four, invest in shaving cream. I always felt like shaving cream was the stupidest thing in the world. I felt like you never need shaving cream. Not to the time you were going to be in the tub or the shower, but shaving cream will come in handy when you didn't know you was going to wear a dress that had like a spaghetti strap or something and you had already showered and already beat your face and everything. Or like when you said you wasn't going to do something, but you about to do something and you don't got time to like get in the shower first and you can just use shaving cream for like quick shaves and stuff like that. Um, number five, I recently learned about body exfoliator and that you should like exfoliate after you shave. I don't know how true that is, but I just wanted to share it with you. But in likeness of like post shave stuff, um, you can also use Neosporin since it's for like cuts and scrapes and stuff like that. It'll prevent you from getting like razor bumps and stuff like that after you shave. Um, and number six, not really a shaving tip, more so just like an alternative. If you don't want to shave or you're too afraid to shave, you can always try um, like hair removal, like V or Nair or stuff like that. But just be careful to make sure you're not putting it like on the wrong parts of your parts of your body, and make sure like you're testing it on your skin first because some of that stuff is really like harmful to sensitive skin. Or another alternative is waxing, which I have not done yet, but I am going to do. And when I do it, I will definitely vlog it because I'm scared. But, um, and I think it'll be a fun experience. So yeah, that's pretty much it. It was just a quick few, you know, shaving tips, hacks. If you have any shaving tips or hacks, be sure to comment them down below to let everybody else know. Or if you try any of these hacks and you had, like, a good experience or a bad experience, go ahead and comment down, comment that down below, too. Also, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. If you like this video, be sure to share this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out.